everyone to episode 5 of Data Science and AI Weekly. My name is Manav. I'm your host for this episode and uh, let's do the honors. If you have not already watched uh, watched the first four episode and if you have not listened to the first four episode, I would highly highly recommend you to do that first. And uh, once you are done that, come back to this episode. This is episode number 5. In this episode, what we are going to cover is what do data science interviews look like and this is going to be an interesting episode because what i'm going to help you see is that how does your entire interview process look like because what a lot of us starting our careers in data science think is that it's just going to be one interview and we are going to be done so it's not like that let's dig deeper into what does a data science interview is all about so there are three stages of what a typical data science interview looks like the first one is the screening round so this in this round essentially say a job has been posted on linkedin you have applied for that particular role so the hr calls you uh, if they find your profile suitable and uh, let's say that your the company is looking for a data scientist position and you meet the skill set the hr will call you and they will screen you whether what you have written in your resume and what the company wa- wants if there is a good overlap between the two if the hr feels that there is a good overlap between the two right then you will be called for a interview day on the interview day what ends up happening is you don't directly go for a face to face interview right you might as well but most top companies would not directly meet you for a face to face interview you will be given a problem statement or a case study and a data science case study and you will be given let's say that you report for the interview at say let's say 9 am 9 am or 10 am you will be given let's say 3 hours or 4 hours to solve that particular case study and depending on whether you have gotten the final result right and whether there is evaluation if for example you have been evaluated that this was a problem statement this is how you have done if you have done horribly bad right you would be asked that your interview is over if you have done reasonably well if you have done really well right you will be called for in person interview after that right now a little twist to some of the interview process is that in a lot of interviews you are not given a task on the day of the interview you might be given a task before the inter- before calling you for in person uh, uh, round itself that is you will be given an assignment to do at your home and you will be given let's say 24 hours to submit back that assignment right now there what i recommend is i recommend you to not take any assistance from any other person expert in the space because in the end even if you make do the task by taking help from some other expert you will most likely be figured out in the interview so you would want to possibly read a little bit about the task on the internet if you need some help but ideally i would recommend that take this as a screening process yourself if you are not able to do that task right most likely you'll not be able to create clear the interview right so you might get a home assignment as well and you might you would usually get 24 hours to submit that assignment and how well you have done on that particular uh, data science task then the company might decide to call you or might decide to drop you at that to drop you at that stage now this is the second stage so first stage was phone screen second stage was a task third stage is going to be an actual interview right and this is the third stage but this is what a lot of candidates think is the only stage but which is not the case there are two other stages that i've already discussed in the third stage you are going to have an interview with your most likely the boss that you're going to be reporting to who might be a senior data scientist he might be a head of data science he might be a chief data scientist or he might be a data scientist itself in your team if uh, it totally depends on at what level of data science maturity the company is at right for example if the company already has a uh, tens of data scientists working in then you might be recruited first of all by a senior data scientist and there might be another round of interview with the chief data scientist or sometimes what can also happen is that there might be and uh, or or the your interview would be one round of interview only right so now let's see that what type of questions are asked right so if 
you have only one round of interview after you've submitted the task then in that round the focus is going to be on three things first of all on knowing you because they are interested in knowing more about your profile the kind of work that you have done secondly they are going to be interested in your knowledge about data science overall why you are in this field what excites you are you aware about the trends and some of the uh, questions regarding algorithms etc which is your favorite algorithm and you might uh, be asked more on that and the third part of the interview is going to be focused on the task itself that you had submitted now in some companies what ends up happening is that because of the, the three parts to the interview the interview ends up becoming very long that's why you have two stay you have two stages of interview in which let's say a senior data scientist in the first round of interview focuses on the task part and sees your approach in the task and that in itself might be a 30 35 or 40 minute interview wherein uh, the interview might start with for example uh, you did the task first of all what did you understand uh, what was the objective of the task how did you approach it what are the possible solutions you thought about what kind of machine learning algorithm you applied which machine learning algorithm did you decide is the best fit can you give me some other example of how this problem could have been solved etc so essentially entire interview would be about task and this is very very common it might take 40 minutes 45 minutes and sometimes it can run all the way up to 60 minutes now if this task based interview goes well then you would have the next round of interview which is focus more about your career most about your about your profile most about your fitment for the role there would be questions about have you researched about the company your typical standard interview questions nothing dramatically different but focused on your fitment for a data science role right but as i said if the company does not want to focus too much on the task both these interviews can also be merged into one so uh, this is the interview round after that you finally get your offer letter uh, based on whether you have actually cracked the role or not so it's a three stage so essentially just to summarize it's a three stage interview process that you need to go through you need to research about each one of these stages so that you are prepared for the phone screen prepared for the task what kind of task come there are whole host of tasks that you can get if you practice for these tasks it may cracking these tasks becomes easier and the interviews as i said I would possibly have a podcast on the kind of interview questions you should expect. This podcast was more about the process. Do listen to this episode that I would be doing soon on the kind of interview questions that you can expect in a data science interview, right? So that was the interview process of data science interviews. I hope you loved this episode. I had a great time sharing my insight about this if you love this episode leave your feedback leave your comment uh, i'm always looking for ideas on topics that you would want podcast to be made of and uh, if you loved this episode make sure that you listen to another episode and do share this episode with with anyone that you know in your circle can benefit from some of the tips that i've shared in this interview right so thank you very much for watching this episode of data science and ai weekly my name is manav i'm signing off and look forward to see you 